بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم مائی نیم از عبد الحنان ٹوڈے آئی ایم گوئنگ ٹو ڈسکس ہاؤ ٹو میک دی کنٹرولر فار ریئل لائٹس آف اے کار دی ورلڈ ڈسکرپشن آف دی پرابلم از ڈیزائن اے کار سرکٹ دیٹ کنٹرول دی ریئل لائٹس آف اے کار لیفٹ اینڈ رائٹ ریئل لائٹس سو فسٹ آف آل بفور میکنگ دا سرکٹ وی نو وٹ سرکٹ وی آر گوئنگ ٹو میک اینڈ وٹ اینڈ پٹس وی آر گوئنگ ٹو یوز اینڈ وٹ آؤٹ پٹ وی ول گیٹ سو آفٹر دی اسٹیٹمنٹ we are going to see what are the inputs and outputs of our system so we are getting the five inputs left turn sin- signal which causes blinking of left side light right turn signal emergency flasher which blinks the both left and right lights brake when brake is applied both lights are on without blinking and one internal signal of one hertz frequency to blink the light and as a result of these all inputs we are getting two outputs left right left light and right light after this we have some conditions in our circuit let's see what are these conditions the conditions are the brake overrides the emergency signal means that when both the brake and emergency signal are simultaneously applied then brake will override the emergency signal means that lights will on without blinking the second condition is the left turn and right turn overrides the brake signals means that when left turn and right turn and brake signals are simultaneously applied then lights will blink for left turn and right turn and no for the brakes here we see that we can make our circuit with three of these ideas minimized SOP decoder with NOR gates and multiplexer in this video I am making the circuit with two of these concepts through minimized SOP and by using multiplexer after this I have made the truth table of left real light and right real light because truth table is very essential for any circuit through truth table we are going to see through what inputs we will get what output So this is the truth table of our left and right rear lights, left, brake, emergency and blink are the inputs and we are getting only left output. Similarly right, brake, emergency and blink are the inputs of second circuit and we will get the right output. When all the signals are 0 we will get output 0, when blink is 1 but no other signal is 1 then we will get output 0 so from this truth table I am going to make the expressions of SOP to make my circuit from these truth tables we see that the truth table of left light and right light is same so we are going to make only one circuit and we use it to make the other circuit of right light now I am going to make the boolean expressions of my circuit here you see the boolean expression of left light by using truth table after the boolean simplification i am getting the this boolean expression of final in which we use three and gates and one three input or gate and one not gate so after all the simplification now i have to make a circuit of this boolean expression on proteus so let's make our circuit now let's start making the circuit now let's start making the circuit
here I am using this as a blinker with I set the frequency of 3 hertz here Now I am just copying this circuit to make circuit of for rear light. Here I am changing this with the right signal and to change this with the right light. Now our second circuit is ready. Now let's run the circuit. When all the signals are zero we are getting the zero output both the lights are off now when i am turning all the emergency you see the lights start blinking which means that our leds are blinking and we are getting the emergency signal when i am applying the brakes you see the lights are continuous on no blinking this means that our brake signal overrides the emergency signal now when I start right turn and similarly left turn the LED start blinking so this proves that now left turn and right turn signals are overriding the brake signal when all the inputs are 1 here also left turn and right turn are overriding the brake and emergency signal. So we make the circuit of left and right rear lights of a car through SOP. Now to make a circuit of left and right rear lights of a car by using multiplexer. Here I am making the circuit of for left light. Here I, you see I am making the connections of output with the blinker. Here 0 0 and blinker are 0 1 means whenever whatever I am applying on blinker I am getting the 0 output. And on the next here you see the output left 0 1 is copying the blinker. So here I am using the blinker as an input and in the next the outputs are 1 1 whatever I am applying on the blinker so here I am just applying the permanent one input on the multiplexer and similarly all these so I am using 8 cross 1 multiplexer to make a circuit of left rear lights with these inputs and 0 1 2 are the conditions of left right brake and emergency which controls the multiplexer so after this now I am going to make a circuit of left rear light by using multiplexer so let's start making the circuit I am using the multiplexer IC number 74151 
these are the input terminals and these are ABC and these are the enable terminal and remaining ones are to be connected with the blinker the ABC terminals are to be connected with the A with the least significant input B with the high and high significant with that and C with the most significant input so I am connecting the C with the left signal B with the break signal and A with the emergency signal this is the output terminal I am using the output The enabler is connected to be the 0 Now I am just copying this circuit to make a circuit for the right rear light. I have to change this with the right light. And this one also with the right light. Now our circuit is ready. Now just run the circuit. First, I have to change this. To use as a blinker. Now our circuit is ready. You see when all the inputs are zero, I am getting the both lights off. Now when I apply the emergency signal, the both lights start blinking. Now when I am applying the brakes, both lights are continuously on, means brake signal is overriding the emergency signal. Now when I am applying the right turn and left turn, the lights start again blinking, means that right turn and left turn are overriding the brake signal and emergency signal. So you see through these ways we can easily make the circuit for the rear lights of a car system very easily by using Proteus through multiplexer and by using also SOPs Boolean expressions. So to make this circuit first of all we need truth table then after the truth table we have to make the Boolean expression to make our circuit. So that's enough for today, Labs. Khuda Office.